Here are the 15 biggest animals that roamed the earth during the last ice age which started around 120,000 years in the past and ended around 11,000 years ago. So most of these animals would have evolved prior or during this time period or went extinct during this time. We will showcase them in ascending order according to weight since some are longer and taller than others but are lighter in weight while others are shorter but heavier. So let's take a look at weight. Let's get to it guys. Number 15. The Iolornis The Iolornis incredibilis is a teraton bird that is now extinct and was found in the western part of the United States. Despite being substantially bigger, it is less well known than its relative the Teratonis meriami. It went extinct approximately 10,000 years ago along with other megafauna of North America. Its wingspan was reported to be between 5 to 5.5 meters or 18 feet and its weight was approximately 25 kilograms or 55 pounds, making it one of the largest flight capable birds if not the largest. Number 14. The Dinornis Dinornis, a flightless New Zealand bird, was possibly the tallest that ever existed, towering 3.6 meters or 12 feet tall and weighing between 230 to 240 kilograms or between 510 to 530 pounds. The feet of these birds were huge and strong and they could execute a deadly kick. These birds possessed long muscular necks and big sharp beaks, allowing them to consume food ranging from subalpine plants in the ground to tree branches. It lived through the Ice Age but went extinct in the 14th century due to hunting by the Maori people. Number 13. The American Lion Panthera atrox, sometimes known as the American Lion or the American Cave Lion, is an extinct giant cat that existed in North America between 340,000 years ago and 11,000 years ago during the Pleistocene till the early Holocene epoch. It was around 25% bigger than a modern lion making it one of the biggest felids ever discovered. The American lion was reported to weigh up to 420 kilograms or 930 pounds and stand 1.2 meters or 4 feet tall at the shoulder. Number 12. The Smilodon It is most well known as the saber-toothed cat and it is one of the most well-known prehistoric animals. The Smilodon was more powerfully constructed than any other existing cat with especially well-developed forelimbs and very large upper canine teeth. The biggest species, the Smilodon populata from South America, weighed between 400 to 500 kilograms or 880 to 1100 pounds and stood 120 centimeters or 4 feet tall at the shoulder, making it one of the largest known felids. These animals went extinct 10,000 years ago. Number 11. The Irish Elk Also known as the Irish Deer, it is an extinct species of the genus Megaloceros and is one of the biggest deer ever to have lived. During the Pleistocene it ranged across Eurasia from Spain to Russia. The Irish elk reached around 2.1 meters or 7 feet tall at the shoulders and had the biggest antlers of any deer, measuring up to 3.6 meters or 12 feet wide. The Irish elk was the biggest known old world deer weighing between 600 kilograms or 1300 pounds to 700 kilograms or 1500 pounds or even more. Number 10. The Giant Short-Faced Bear Also known as the Arctodus, it is an extinct genus of short-faced bear that lived in North America during the Pleistocene period 2.5 million years ago until around 12,000 years ago. Arctodus simus, the biggest species, is currently thought to be a gigantic omnivore as well as one of the biggest known terrestrial mammalian carnivorans. The biggest males were 1.5 meters tall at the shoulder on all fours and could stand up to 3 meters or 10 feet tall on their back legs. They weighed around 800 kilograms but might reach 950 kilograms or 2,000 pounds in the biggest individuals. Number 9. The Arctotherium This is a genus of another type of Pleistocene short-faced bears which are native to Central and South America. So during the Great American Interchange, the Arctotherium traveled from North to South America and diversified and specified there. This species, Angustodens, is expected to stand between 3.4 to 4.3 meters or 11 to 14 feet tall on two legs and weigh at least 1,200 kilograms or 2,600 pounds. It would make this species the largest bear ever discovered as well as one of the largest carnivorous land mammals ever to exist. Number 8. The Glyptodon Extinct about 11,000 years ago, the Glyptodons are part of a superorder of mammals known as 
Xenothra. This includes anteaters, tree slots, armadillos and extinct ground slots and bampotheres. The most prominent feature of this animal is the huge turtle-like shell and a short tail. It measured about 3 to 3.3 meters or around 10 feet in length, 1.5 meters or 5 feet in height and weight up to 2 tons or 4400 pounds. Its hot shell gives it an ankylosaurus kind of appearance. Number 7. The Woolly Rhinoceros The Woolly Rhinoceros is an extinct species that lived in Europe and Asia throughout the Pleistocene era and persisted until the end of the last glacial period. It had a long, thick fur of hair that let it thrive on the freezing, unforgiving mammoth steppes. It developed to be nearly the same size as a white rhinoceros, measuring 2 meters or 6.5 feet tall at the shoulder and 4.6 meters or 15 feet long. And its weight is estimated to be around 2,000 kilograms, 2 tons, or 4,400 pounds. Number 6. The Megatherium This is an extinct genus of South American ground sloth that lived from the early Pliocene until the end of the last glacial period. It is well known for its elephant-sized body. The Megatherium americanum, sometimes known as the famous giant ground sloth or the Megatherium, is one of the biggest terrestrial animals ever recorded weighing up to 4 tons or 8,800 pounds and measuring up to 6 meters or 20 feet long from head to tail. Number 5. The Eremotherium This was a member of another family of ground sloth that went extinct around 10,000 years ago at the end of the Ice Age. It was larger than the closely related species the Megatherium, reaching an overall length of 6 meters or 20 feet and a height of 2 meters or 6.5 feet on all fours but could reach a height of 4 meters or 13 feet tall when standing on its hind legs. Its weight estimates range from 3 to 6.5 tons, or up to 14,400 pounds, with a median of around 5,000 kilograms or 5 tons. Number 4. The Elasmotherium This is an extinct genus of giant rhinoceros that was native to Eurasia from the late Miocene to the Pleistocene and living as recently as 39,000 years ago during the last glacial era. The Elasmotherium sibiricum, sometimes known as the Siberian unicorn, was the size of a mammoth and was said to have a big thick horn on its forehead, which means it was 8.5 feet tall at the shoulder, weighing around 5 tons or 1100 pounds and had a horn that was 2 meters long. Number 3. The Woolly Mammoth This is one of the most well-known Ice Age mammal. It is an extinct species of mammoth that flourished from the Pleistocene period until its demise during the Holocene epoch, it was also the last in a long series of mammoth species. The woolly mammoths were nearly the size of current African elephants. Males had shoulder heights ranging from 2.7 to 3.4 meters or 8.9 to 11.2 feet and weighed up to 6 tons. Number 2. The American Mastodon and the Colombian Mammoth These two different types of elephant species are contenders for the second spot, with each having a weight estimate of around 10 tons. The visual differences of these two creatures are as follows. The Mastodon is shorter but more robust built than the Colombian Mammoth which is taller but of the same weight. The Mastodon's tusks are straight while the Colombian Mammoths are very curvy and very long. And the biggest, the Paleoloxodon nematicus. The Paleoloxodon genus of straight tusk elephants are no doubt one of the largest animals to ever walk the earth, only surpassed by the sauropod dinosaurs. The Indian Paleoloxodon nematicus was also possibly the largest known land mammal with a height of 5.2 meters or 7 feet tall at the shoulder and weighing over 22 tons. They all went extinct during the last ice age around 24 to 24,000 years ago. So those are the largest animals to exist during the last ice age. So I hope you have enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button for support and subscribe. But most of all, smash that bell icon for regular updates on new videos here on this channel. Take care, fam.